When it comes to attracting a high value man, class is key ladies, but how does he know if you've got it? And why does it matter so much to them, Cynthia? Well, I want you to stick around until the very end of this video because I'm gonna spill the beans on the top seven things that men look for to see if you're actually classy and you're actually in tune with your feminine energy or not. Hello, my beautiful ladies. Welcome to the Feminine Energy Motivation channel, or welcome back if you're already subscribed. I'm glad you're here again. Um, yesterday, I actually, uh, or day before yesterday, I took my son to go get his um, uh, haircut for his senior ball. And while I was waiting in the parking lot, I kind of wanted to take a quick moment to kind of share some things about what I'm going to be talking about today. So um, I'm Cynthia, if you haven't heard from me before, um, and I have some juicy insights for you today. So I hope you're ready, when, especially when it comes to the dating game. It's easy to, to just get caught up in the idea that guys only care about one thing, right? And that's your body or your looks or maybe even your job or material possessions, whatever it is. But to tell you the truth, high value men are actually interested in something a lot deeper than just the surface level stuff. So what exactly makes a high value man first? Let's talk about that first, right? I want you to picture this. He's like the cream of the crop. He's confident, he's driven, and incredibly respectful. He knows what he wants and isn't afraid to go after it. And when you're with him, you end up feeling like you're on top of the world. You're supported, you feel appreciated and incredibly respected. Now on the flip side, however, we've got the not so high value fellas, right? These guys might end up lacking that sort of confidence or ambition or even basic respect. They could leave you feeling undervalued and incredibly unsatisfied. And who wants that, right? But here's the kicker. When you aim high and set your sights on a high value man, you're not just looking for a partner who checks all those boxes. Mm -mm. You're actually seeking a deeper connection that is built on a more solid foundation of mutual respect and communication and even shared goals. That's the benefit of dating a high value man. So let's break it down a little bit more though, because there's more to this. High value men are drawn to high value women, period. They're looking for substance, not just a fling. And trust me, if a woman doesn't meet his standards, it's only a matter of time before he moves on. Now, when it comes to spotting those not so high value guys, I wanna share some things with you because there are a few key things to look out for. All right, <clears throat> I want you to think lack of confidence, unclear uh, goals, or even emotional maturity, right? It, it's all lacking and maybe even lack of respect. Those are all red flags and they can lead to heartache, especially down the road. So let's not forget about the importance of financial stability as well. High value men are providers and protectors, and they want to take care of their partners in every way possible, which are all rooted in a man who is tapped into his masculine energy. So if financial stability is important to you, and let's be real, it's pretty important to many of us, right? I want you to keep an eye out for a man who's got his ducks in a row. Now, on to the perks of dating a high value man. <laughs> oh boy, are they many. Um, I can't cover them all here, right? But we're gonna talk about a few of them. Um, but from open and honest communication to unwavering emotional support, shared ambitions even, and, and yeah, even financial stability, like we said, right? These guys have got it all. They got it going on, all right? But first, I want us to talk about something really important. Class. When it comes to attracting a high value man, Class is key, ladies, but how does he know if you've got it? And why does it matter so much to them, Cynthia? Well, I want you to stick around until the very end of this video because I'm gonna spill the beans on the top seven things that men look for to see if you're actually classy and you're actually in tune with your feminine energy or not. This is what will make him see a future with you rather than just a short-term fling. So it is important to embrace these qualities on a deep level ladies not just put on a facade that he will eventually see through and you will not be able to keep up that persona let's be honest all right this persona that you create will only lead to heartache especially as he decides to end it or move on emotionally which looks a lot like ghosting mm -hmm. all right so if you're ready to attract a classy, high value man who sees your true worth and treats you like the queen that you are, it is important to exude class. 
not just on the surface, but deep within you, all right? And you must also remember to aim high. Embrace your femininity, ladies, and never settle for anything less than you deserve, all right? So buckle up, ladies, because we're diving into the secrets of what it means to truly have class. I hope you're ready. So let's get started. Now, I'm kind of going in this order for a particular reason, but the first one on my list is an important trait of a classy woman. It's not the most important, but it's pretty darn important. And that is kindness. Now, kindness goes beyond just being respectful. It's about how you make people feel. I want you to think about it. How do you interact with others? Do they feel seen? Do they feel heard, right? Do you make them feel valued and appreciated? Do you leave a positive and lasting impression in every interaction that you have with just about anybody? So I want to kind of uh, talk about how I'm working on a few more videos as it relates to how to build rapport and truly captivate people. But in the meantime, I have other videos on my channel that you can check out where I kind of touch on these topics just a little bit, right? For how to accomplish that sort of charm and sort of tapping into those feminine traits that make you so sexy and irresistible, all right? So... Let's get back into it though. A high value man, he plays he pays close attention to how you behave in those platonic relationships. So for example, how do you treat your friends? How do you treat your family and even strangers? He's watching because he wants to see how you might end up treating him and the important people in his life someday in the future. That's the truth. So kindness is incredibly attractive to a high value man. It's incredibly attractive to a lot of people, but mainly the high value man that you're interested in right? That you're generally kind to everyone around her, right? That sort of exudes a special kind of charm that's hard to resist. So embrace your kind heart and let it shine. It's one of the sexiest things that you can bring to the table. Now, let's talk about another trait that high value men pay attention to. How respectful you are towards others. When a man is interested in you, he wants to be able to introduce you to his friends, to his family, and any other important people in his life, like maybe his coworker or his boss, right? But if you're disrespectful or even inconsiderate, he's going to end up losing interest in you faster than you can say, check please, all right? Now, I'm not saying you have to be boring, ladies. That's not what I'm saying here, right? Men want you to have fun um, and be yourself, right? But part of being classy is knowing how to have a good time while also being respectful and kind. And if you do slip up, it's important to own it and take accountability, of course, right? He's definitely going to notice that. And it will speak loudly of your level of respect for not only him and also yourself when you're able to take that accountability right away. Take it on the chin and own up to it and just say, oh, you know, I apologize. But speaking of accountability, it's a trait that is super important in, in, any, in any human being, really. Um, but we're not going to dive into that right here, right now. It's worth noting that men who are looking for a serious partner, however, they actually care more about your character than just your looks. They want someone that they can be proud to call their wife or even the mother of their children someday. That's the truth. And a woman who displays respect towards others is actually showing that she respects herself as well. All right. Now, I want us to talk about number three. Uh, that is something really important as well, which is emotional maturity. This is one of the key things that tell men that you're a classy woman worth their time, that you've actually invested time in yourself to learn, to be, to do, to grow, right? That's what you're doing here right now. So what does emotional maturity look like? Let's talk about that. It's about having a handle on your feelings and being able to express them in a healthy and productive way. Men love being in relationships with women who bring that sort of stability and fulfillment to the table right? I want you to see it this way. Emotional maturity brings a sense of calmness and makes communication flow smoothly in the relationship. Have you ever heard of a guy complain about a woman who's being overly dramatic or out of control? Yeah, that's not a good look, right? Emotional volatility is a big red flag. You want to be the kind of woman who stays cool and collected even when things get tough. That right there is a sure sign of class. When a man sees that you're in control of your emotions, it makes him respect you even more, all right? So I want you to aim to be the kind of woman who sets the standard for emotional maturity. You want men to look at you and think, wow, she's got it together. I need to step up my game to be on her level. That's the kind of impression on a man that you wanna leave. Let's be honest, all right? 
Now, I want us to talk about this other one, which is an important trait of a classy woman, right? But it's modesty. Now, this doesn't mean that you have to dress, no offense to anybody in the audience, right? Like a nun or Amish, right? Um, but look, like if you're from a different century or anything like that, or never wear makeup, right? You, you can still look stunning without shouting, hey, look at me, right? To everyone in the room. I think it's beautiful to be attractive. I think it's, it's very encouraged, right? Especially on my channel. But here's the thing. Creating a sense of mystery and intrigue is key. Men are naturally pursuers. So leaving a little something to the imagination is going to make him drawn to you even more. So as you grow closer, you can slowly start to reveal a little bit more of yourself, both physically and even emotionally. I want you to think of it like this. A buffet versus a fancy restaurant. Buffets have all the food on display and people just grab what they want quickly, right? But at a fancy restaurant, right, the experience is about slowly revealing each course from the appetizer all the way to the dessert, right? High value men prefer this kind of slow buildup. They're not typically drawn to buffets. Now, some of you might say, yeah, Cynthia, but I'm a little shy. Isn't that a turnoff? Actually, being shy can be incredibly attractive. It adds an air of mystery to you, making men wonder what you're thinking, what, what's going on in your head, right? But here's the thing. Being too reserved might actually mean that you're putting yourself out there in a way that kind of draws men away from you because you're not actually meeting them, right? So you got to put yourself out there. But remember, the perfect man isn't about, you know, coming and knocking on your door, right? You have to get out there. You have to meet new people. And don't worry, I'm here to help you ladies, all right? Because I get it's a little intimidating. So if you feel like you need some guidance in this area, you can actually book a session with me. You can check out the details in the description below for more information, all right? But let's get you out there and start attracting the high value man that you want and deserve, all right? Now, number five, let's talk about another important aspect that tells men that you're a classy woman. Pride. Now, I'm not talking about feeling superior. No, that's not what I'm talking about, right? But when I say pride, I actually mean how you take care of the things that you own. For example, your clothes, your car, your home, and even your body. A high value man wants to see that you're going to make a great partner someday. So if you're the kind of woman who takes excellent care of your belongings, hits the gym, stays organized, you're actually sending a message loud and clear that says, I go the extra mile for what matters to me. I want you to think about it this way. When you bring a man into your home for the first time, do you want him to see a cluttered mess? Or do you want to create a warm and inviting space that makes him feel welcome? A classy woman knows that anything worth doing is worth doing really, really well. Okay? So I want you to take pride in yourself and your surroundings. Show him that you're someone who values quality and actually puts effort into everything that you do. It's the little details that make a big impression and actually sets you apart as a high value woman. It's unfortunate to admit, but not a lot of women are high value. So next one, let's talk about another important quality that shows men that you're a classy woman, number six. And this is resilience. So life throws us curveballs quite often, right? The question is, how do you handle those setbacks? A classy woman faces challenges with grace and composure. So instead of pointing fingers and blaming other people, right, she takes a step back, she assesses the situation, and even takes responsibility for her part in it, her actions. She's not one to fold under pressure. She tackles problems head on until she finds a solution. You see, a high value man admires a woman who knows how to handle herself. He doesn't want to feel like he has to tell her how to behave or what's right or what's wrong. It's not his job to police her actions, right? Now, sure, there might be things that are important to you that he doesn't agree with, like, I don't know, let's say posting revealing pictures on social media or even staying out late at nightclubs or whatever floats your boat, right? And that's okay. It's all about compatibility at the end of the day. If you want to find a man who's okay with those sort of things, then, you know, keep looking, right? But the truth is, there's someone out there who aligns with your values and your desires. That's the truth, right? I'm not going to sugarcoat it and tell you that you have to be a certain way. But remember, a high value man actually values compatibility and shared values. 
So it's important to keep that in mind as you navigate the dating world with these high value men, right? So last but not least, I want us to talk about the seventh trait and that is independence. This is all about being self-sufficient and not relying on others for your happiness or your security. A classy, independent woman has her own goals and ambitions. She knows that she needs to be secure within herself before she can truly invite a man into her life. She understands that in order to fully invest in a relationship and enjoy that sort of reward that comes from being in that kind of relationship, she has to first invest in herself. You're doing it right now by watching my video. But here's the thing. She doesn't give up her independence or the things that she loves because a man enters her life. No, right? Instead, she enhances her life with his presence just as he enhances her, or excuse me, he enhances his life with, with yours, right? So ladies, I want you to keep in mind and remember that being independent does not mean shutting others out. It means being strong and secure in yourself so that you can bring even more to the table in your relationships while still leaning back into your feminine energy. All right, so important. So I want us to talk about something as it relates to these traits that tell men that you're a classy woman because I want to shift your perspective just a little bit. So instead of thinking, okay, Cynthia, I'll do all these things to attract my dream man. Mm, no, I want you to see it as personal growth. You're investing in yourself, all right? These traits aren't just about snagging a guy. They're about becoming a better, more well-rounded person. You see, having class isn't about feeling superior to others, not at all. It's actually quite warm and inviting. It's about cultivating a magnetic energy, right? That draws people in, especially the man that you are truly interested in and will ultimately be happier with in the long term and hopefully married to if that's your desire, all right? When you work on these traits, you're not just becoming more attractive to potential partners. You're actually becoming the best version of yourself, which is worth all the money in the world. Let's be honest. By watching this video, like I said, and the others on my channel that I have, right? You are investing in yourself, your growth, and even your future ahead. So I'm proud of you for taking these steps, my ladies. It's not easy to admit defeat sometimes and that we need to grow. We're a student of life, right? Always striving, don't you think? All right, ladies, <laughs> that wraps up today's video. Thank you, ladies, so, so much for subscribing to the channel. I appreciate you choosing to learn about love and dating and relationships with me. But remember... As relationships evolve, so do we, all right? Continuously growing, live the life you love and love the life you live. Have a wonderful and blessed day. I love you guys so much. Catch you on the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.